And if one is absent up to a certain number of time, then one can be asked to vacate their seat. But you first have to determine whether he's absent or not and how many times he's absent. That determination has to be made by the parliament. Now, if that determination is made and it is found that he's absent 11 times, and let us say the rules of parliament say that after 11 times, he must vacate the seat and he refuses to vacate the seat, then you go to the court and you say, court, look, the constitution says that if you're absent in accordance with the rules of the parliament, then you must vacate your seat. Well, we have checked the rules of the parliament and the parliament has done that and the parliament has determined that he is absent 11 times and in accordance with the rules of the parliament, he must leave parliament and he is not leaving. I am now coming to you to invoke this section of the constitution to throw him out of the parliament. Only so you can come to the constitution. You have to determine the matter in the parliament itself. The court can go into parliament to read the register. The court can read the rules of the parliament to determine who is sitting and who is absent. Is that the court's business? That is the speaker's business.